reason why I take two rest days in my story. Why do I take two rest days? So pretty much that's how my morning is going. Relatively simple, everything's pretty much the same. I do everything in order. So as you see, I woke up. I ain't kicked the sheets, but I woke up, got right to my prayer, said my prayer, got up, made my bed, you know, obviously brushed our teeth, washed our face, washed my hair. I don't do too much to my hair. I just put water in it and I put coconut oil in it and it keeps it nice and soft and moisturized throughout the day. And then after that, um, I figure out, I look at the planner, what we have to do today. On this list is pretty much just filming this video, not throughout my day. Off topic, my sister got crumble cookies, bro. Terrible, terrible. Yeah, man. Yeah, I'm gonna see if I can get a massage today. I'm gonna see if I can go to the, um, get a massage today and take you guys through like a whole rest day. What I do, why it's important to take rest days. I take two a week, though, today and then Sunday. And I'm gonna explain why. So make sure I stay tuned. Hey, hey. You wanna say hi to people? You wanna say good morning? You going to bed? Look, she's still tired. You can see her eyes. Hey, you gonna say good morning to him? Lay down. Go lay down. All right, the second thing I usually do, I usually go to Wawa to grab some coffee. Like, I've been trying to express to you guys, like, the coffee at Wawa is mad cheap, and it's good, too. And they have this pumpkin flavor. It's, like, a limited edition pumpkin uh, spice. Oh, my God, that flavor is so fire. I usually go there. I go to Starbucks sometimes. I really don't have no, like, I don't know. I don't know. Starbucks hasn't just been, it hasn't been hitting for me lately. So, just be really just going to Wawa, just getting the hot coffee. Depends where I, how I'm feeling. I usually go to a 24-ounce or a 20-ounce. Today, I might do to a 24-ounce just because, because it's a rest day and I'm, I'm not using any pre-workout today or anything like that so for ounce of coffee today you do fat free that's french vanilla creamer like most of it and then I, do, I usually do like a drop or two of the um regular french vanilla just to get a little bit more flavor to it but yeah after that i'm home you guys want to see come home i'll usually be my favorite breakfast protein pancakes so go to with some strawberries on top go to literally i or i usually just go to uh chick-fil-a and get a chicken biscuit but i'm not going to do that today because i'm really just trying to stay on plan as you can see it's 8 31 right now 8.31 right now, so let's see if I can get a massage later on today. Probably like around like 12, 11, 12 o'clock before I head to work. And then, yeah, that'll be pretty much the day. Then I'm gonna take you guys like what I eat throughout the day. Cause I have already had my meals packed. I'm gonna take you guys through that. Yeah, let's grab this coffee and I'm gonna see you guys when we get there. Well, I'm gonna see you guys when we get back. Drop in the comments if y'all uh if y'all like coffee or not, man. If y'all drink coffee and if you do, what kind of coffee do you drink? And like, where do you get it from? So drop it in the comments if you guys drink coffee. And if so, where do you get it from? Starbucks or Dunkin' or Wawa? And then drop your drop your orders because I'm trying to try new things. So drop your orders. And yeah, I'm going to catch you guys when we get back. All right, so we're back at the Kripsky. Got my coffee. Pumpkin spice. French vanilla creamer. Free French vanilla creamer. Four packets of like the little zero calorie sugar thingies. Fire, bro. Fire. Every time. I'm going to make uh, our breakfast now. And I'm going to show you guys a little montage, whatever. Or, and then, yeah. breakfast was simple um high protein and the fats are pretty high from the sausages but i'm purposely doing that one because it's a rest day i'm gonna keep my you know my carbs and my fats high muscles can recover and also around my meals throughout the day my calories are relatively low especially my carb and my fat so i want to get all my fats done through the morning so i have uh, the most energy and yeah so we're gonna knock this down and go on with the day probably gonna start some editing uh it's 9 40 so probably gonna start some editing to like 11 and we're gonna go to uh get our massage so yeah see you guys later all right, so we're actually headed right now to go get the massage. I don't have like a scheduled appointment. I could just literally show up because it's like it's not really packed. So we're gonna go uh, just walk in. Hopefully, I can bring the camera in here. Um, they shouldn't have a problem. I'm just gonna say I'm vlogging for you know my day to day life. So hopefully, I don't have a problem. I can show you guys, you know, the whole massage breakdown, everything like that. Uh, I think I'm gonna get my back, shoulders, and I don't know whatever. So we're gonna tap in there. And then I have to go to the camera store to get a new cloth for the lens and stuff because I can't find my other one, and I actually need it because it's a highly important tool that you need, especially keeping your lens. And 
and I need filter clears. Yep, I'm gonna go there. And then I'm gonna catch you guys when we get to the massage parlor. Yes, sir. So this is the massage parlor. We're gonna go see and go inside to see if my bad. To see what kind of like services they have. I know they have like the it was like a massage chair quickly fixed. They have like an acupuncture, massage therapy, head, shoulder nerves, all that kind of stuff. So we're gonna see uh what services they have. I just need my back, shoulders, like I need the real deal experience. So we're gonna go tap in right now. Yeah, I'm gonna go on there real quick and come back out, grab the camera, slide up in there. So let's see if this works. I can do it. You do yourself, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know which which way we're going. You do the all right, so we just got done the massage. I didn't, what's it called? I didn't record, because obviously you can't really record. You can't record while you're in a massage parlor, so um, out of respect for them, I didn't record, put the camera down. But it was tough though, a little hour. I ain't expect to pay $85 for that, John. I ain't gonna lie to you. Was it worth $85? Uh, probably not, but it was cool. My body felt relaxed, felt calm. It was kind of like a self-improvement tactic, you feel me, that everybody should do, is to get a massage. So yeah, finish some, finish some content, uh, make something to eat. I have everything cooked already, make something to eat. Uh, get ready for work. I'm gonna head to work and I'm gonna catch you guys later. So yeah. We just arrived back at the crib. I uh, just got done work. I wanna go grab some Chick-fil-A. I just got a nugget meal, some fries and milkshake. Just to end the night off. I didn't really eat too much today. So we're just gonna uh, knock that out. We have that right here. I'm gonna finish some more editing, stuff like that. And then once I'm done that, I have everything uploaded for this week. Yeah, man. I'm gonna catch you guys tomorrow and this video. Come on, because he like... So we're gonna try Taylor's cookies. This is a new box right here. So she has like new flavors. She has First of all, like... oil cookie crunch. She has a s'more. I think it's a brownie <laughs> one. Ooh, low hammer. She's dropping them on the floor. This has like... Mm -hmm. So the graham cracker, you definitely can taste the marshmallow the chocolate. The next one I'm gonna try is... This is a vanilla Oreo crunch. Don't mind the nose. Low hammer. Look at that thing right there. Are you so close? This one, so besides chocolate chip, this one's my second favorite. Got like a, like a white chocolate Oreo. Oh, this one's good. Um, definitely go over to Taylor's Cookies. Get you some. And shout out to Taylor because these cookies are bomb. Homemade. Nice quality cookie. She even puts a little card in there with her business card. Freshly baked. And she even gives like a little... So if you're not eating Taylor's cookies, what y'all doing? I actually went to stop and grab something from the store. She already know we had to go to Aldi, so... We grabbed some cocoa puffs. I'm gonna literally make this with my protein powder because it's cocoa game. So the chocolate with the chocolate is gonna be, you know what I'm saying? It's top tier. Organic chicken breast, chicken thighs, the chicken thighs. You gotta get the boneless chicken thighs. The boneless chicken thighs are leanest ones. I have an obsession with strawberry pop tarts. So I usually get these at work for like a snack purpose for like carbs and stuff like that if I'm running low. So I usually just have you know, one of these things right here. Yeah, and I got organic ground beef. Then you guys know some zucchini. For the veggies, that's pretty much what I got right now. I kind of want to like touch on a little bit on why I take two rest days and why it's very important. Why do I take two rest days? I do like a two day on, one day off method. So I will lift Monday, Friday, off Wednesday, lift Thursday, Friday. And I'll take, I'll, I'll switch my days. So I will lift on, I will rest day on Sunday I'll, when I have church and I'll, I'll lift on Saturday. It's kind of like a two day one off type of lift. What it does is it allows me to uh, hit each body part twice a week. I'm going to be more effective with like my workouts and things like that. So being able to rest you know, throughout the week on like a Wednesday definitely like takes a toll off. Like I, I when I rest on Wednesdays, I don't do cardio. So I'll get up. I'll do like my normal routine. You guys saw. I'll make breakfast and then I'll pretty much like relax. I won't even do like too much content because a lot of people get mixed up. Like a rest day is supposed to be not even just your muscles and your body. It's just, it's your mind too. Having that rest day, you know, you want to have your clear mind. You want to have a clear mind and you're going to start getting in your head. You know, then you're going to start overthinking like oh i lose this i'm lose gains this this and that but when you have a clear mind bro have a clear path so my rest days i pretty much just prioritize resting now, my body feels 10 times better and throughout my rest days i, I usually just do a thorough gun or if you guys saw i want to go get a massage i usually don't do that but it was it was something new that i wanted to try yeah man so that's pretty much it um i really advise anybody to you know it depends what fits your needs uh don't just do it because you see me doing it or you see somebody else doing it you know what fits your needs maybe you do one day off i mean one day on two days off or you know you do three days on one day off you know it, it all depends on how your body responds don't just copy somebody else because you see them you know looking a certain way you want to copy that do what your body feels and do what's going to help you, you know achieve your goals Listen to your body even if you, you know can go six days a week i recommend not doing that because i did it and then my body was hurting but if you could do six days a week five days straight you know and your body's telling you hey listen i need a break take a break bro like two days even if you you know you push you know monday, monday through friday rest saturday and sunday 
Sunday. Like I've done that, you know what I'm saying? But I recommend doing like a rest day in between the week and then definitely on the weekend just to get your mind right, get your body recovered for the next week so you can tag every single task that you have in mind and achieve your goals and whatever you want to accomplish. So that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you want more kind of content like this, make sure you drop it down in the comments below. Let me know what you guys want to see. I'm gonna do my best to bring this to the channel. I want to do like a whole different kind of vibe to this channel, a different vibe to the content. I want to do what's going to help you guys, not just help me. But um, if you're new, definitely hit that subscribe button, like the video, comment, because it helps with the algorithm, helps push the video out to people that need to see this. And come join the family, man. Up, bro. I'm gonna catch y'all in the next one. Also, yeah, Code Dre for the Lost Break, Code Dre for Alpha Lion and T Chanley skincare routine for all my men that are struggling with the skincare down below in the description. Check it out. You get 30% off and a free gift when you use that link. Yeah, man, I'm gonna catch you guys in the next one. Love you guys. Stay blessed.